They slither among us on trails and even stopping in to visit us at our homes. If you see a rattlesnake, consider yourself lucky because these are our species that you're not going to see every day. On Wednesday, rattlesnakes were spotted at two locations across the Okanagan Valley, one in Penticton and another one in Lake Country. The other dog ran outside and then it, I clicked in what was going on and then I heard it and then I was like, get in the house, get in the house, get in the house. Thankfully, he didn't get the pupper. He was in defensive strike mode, like for sure. Like, yeah, he was ready to go. Oh, I didn't notice it at first and then it started uh, moving. I picked up my dog. <laughs> I warned these other bikers that were coming by about it, and the one lady jumped off her bike. She didn't know what I was saying. A snake biologist says that there are a lot of rattlesnakes in the Okanagan Valley, but in the past 100 years, only two people that were bitten by a rattlesnake have died. On average, we get around two to three bites in the Okanagan per year. This is not a dangerous species. This is something that we can coexist with easily, and it's something that people don't need to be afraid of. They need to be aware of it. A lot of people hear a snake rattle and they're like, oh, it's being really aggressive towards me. That's not what's happening. It's trying to say, I'm here, please don't step on me. And I tell people that rattlesnakes are one of the easiest snakes to be around because of this feature, because they're, they're letting you know where they are. And the Okanagan snakes are a bit different than snakes from other provinces. The snakes out west are more chilled out, so they don't rattle quite as easily as the ones in Alberta. Dunn says 50% of snake bites are actually dry bites and they won't actually inject venom. Call for help. You're going to want to move to medical uh, uh, aid as quickly as possible. But that being said, you don't want to run around. You don't want to use your body a ton. They want to be as far away from us as possible. And we just need to allow them their habitat to do that. So if you do see a rattlesnake, here's a tip from Dunn. Snakes do a lot of their sensing through vibration. So they'll feel you coming before they can see you or before they're going to sense you uh, using other methods. If, if you have the stick, you can the best thing that you can do with it is stay at least uh, a meter and a half away from the snake and just bang it at your feet uh, that way the snake will feel the vibrations and will want to move away from you just make sure a rattlesnake doesn't feel cornered and the only direction it can go is towards you Alana Kelly Castanet News Kelowna